Hi, Magpie. I had this glorious idea of doing like a fast forward intro of me circuit bending this, but all I'm finding is like a pitch down. Okay, so my plan was to circuit bend this one before I showed you and did stuff, but we're gonna jump straight over there. Cause it's just gonna have this switch. I bet it's circuit bendable, but I don't really have the patience to do it. It's the Stylophone Beatbox. Possibly a contender for worst drum machine ever. Although I've already had a contender for worst drum machine ever on this channel. But this one is ridiculous. Uh, let's go over there, though. Shook, shook. One, two, one, two, three, four. Tell me I'm your dirty ho- Okay, this is the Stylophone beatbox. The weirdest thing in the Stylophone series, this is strange. It's a drum machine, but you play it like a Stylophone. You got three modes. You see, that was a drum mode. Then you have the beatbox mode. Stylophone. Yeah! <laughs> and the bass. It's got an output and also MP3 in. Cause that, that's good to have. I have a really hard time understanding who this was geared towards. Like is it just a gimmick? It is very gimmicky. Maybe it was uh, like, uh, oh, let's do this for Christmas or whatever. People can get this for Christmas. It's very strange because it really is really, really bad. Uh, who came up with the idea at Stylophone Trademark Corporations that it would be a fun idea to play drums with this? <laughs> That high pitch sound though. Fart. What? 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 So, so, hit it. So, very. What? What? So, so, what? It's six tricky. What's it called that? The snowboard game? However, just want to give a quick shout out. If you want to see an entire YouTube channel dedicated to bad gear, there is the YouTube channel that is, it's not called Bad Gear, it's a series on the YouTube channel. I don't remember, Pilts something? Great content exploring real gear, but the bad side of it. So two thumbs up to that. Over here, more obscure. But I think I'm gonna collect all the samples. I'm uh, actually doing it with all of these. I've been doing it for a while now, but uh, to drop a sample pack, so that's kind of fun. But let's make a beat as well. Let's see if I get inspired from this. Uh. I really like that you can like record and then play it. Let's jam to this. Mm -hmm. Okay, that was cute. Tiny sounds, always nice. Let's make something a tiny bit more funny by adding one more kick drum. <laughs> yes! Okay, so far, so good. But now, now what do we do? <laughs> Okay, I may obviously I made a hi hat thing with that hi hat sound, but uh, I did stuff. Ooh, who are you? <laughs> but let, let's get some chords to this. Okay, smooth, cute chords. Let's 
and a bass as well. Wow, I also... My ears got fucked. Sounds really weird. I wonder if it was when playing this one. Frequencies being so fucked up. They broke my ear. Artsy. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Uh, mm -hmm. Yes, yes, because it's useless. Doesn't mean that I won't do so. I'm hearing especially when I sing but I did something with it uh, but it really is god-awful but it has certain sounds that I really like as soon as I EQ them a bit uh, like the kick drum and the tiny tiny snare uh, uh, I'm gonna continue experimenting with uh, other things there's a lot of things in here that I haven't done a video with uh, that I really want to make videos with. Uh, I'm done with the toy album, still gonna do a lot of toy videos, but moving over to starting a lot of songs, and that's my comfort zone, so to speak. Just doing something, see what happens, then I have a ton of songs starting. So that's what I'm gonna do. Um, 